Hi Mobiscribers, today I will be talking about some additional features that have been added recently in the Home Reader app. Go ahead and open up your favorite book using Home Reader and we can begin. I've already opened up my favorite Android development book, so let's begin. In order to go to the additional features, tap on the middle of the screen to show the whole toolbar on the bottom of the screen. And on the right side of that toolbar will be the additional features that have been added. The first feature I will go over is the page flipping. So what it means is that you can select portions of your page, whether you're right or left handed, uh, to flip through the book once you finish the page. Uh, the first one that I will demonstrate is the right hand preference. So that would be the left side right here. I will select it, tap out of the screen. And now if I'm finished with the page that I'm reading, I can tap on the right side of the screen to go to the next page. To go to the previous page, I will select on the left side. With there being a right-sided preference, of course there is a left-sided preference for all the left-handers out there. So what I can do with my left hand, if I want to go forward, I tap on the left side of the screen to go forward. And then if I want to go to the previous page, I will tap on the right side. And as you can see, they're quite opposites of each other for right and left hand preference. The next feature I will go over will be to adjust the brightness of the Mobiscribe's backlight. Now, if you turn this on, Basically what it means is that uh, with the backlight on, which I will also turn on, if you want to turn on their backlight, there is a button on the top of the MobiScribe with now that it's on. You can swipe on the left edge with your finger and it will adjust the brightness. So swiping down will decrease the brightness like so. And then swiping up will increase the brightness, like so. I feel like this is a very handy feature just because, you know, maybe you're reading a book in bed at late at night and, uh, you know, you don't want to go through all the settings to, you know, adjust it. So you can just do that with your finger right there. And then the next feature, we will be showing your reading progress. So what you do is turn that on, tap the middle of the screen to get away to show like hide the uh, toolbar on the bottom you'll see the time you'll see where you are in your book from a scroll bar you'll see what page you're on and how many pages there are left the next feature will be the auto hyphenation so with most pdfs uh, it will kind of push the text down one line if if it's um, longer than the line that it's on <clears throat> with this auto hyphenation it will try to complete the whole sentence in one line with the dash so that it will save more space on the screen so i'll turn that on and show you so right here as you saw earlier it changed the position uh, to try to fit everything on one line and i feel like that's also pretty convenient to show more text on the screen mm -hmm. i hope this tutorial has helped you out uh, thank you for tuning in